So unfortunately, we could not find any chili seeds in there. <laughs> Hi guys, so just yesterday we have uh, gone to Metro and bought a few plants. So let me just introduce you to them before we go ahead and decide to plant them in the uh, backyard. So first of all, we have this one over here. So this is, if you see, called the red beef steak. So we got this tomato because our landlord told us that it would be a really yummy tomato to have. So we got this and we got two of these so that you know we can have enough tomatoes to be produced throughout the summer. So next we also got coriander. Uh, if you remember we have planted some coriander seeds but uh, there is no news. We don't see any uh, anything growing up yet. So we decided to get something and try to plant it. So I got two different types just to try which one works. Uh, one is from uh, Freeman Herbs. So it looks something like that. And the other one is just uh, from Harvest Time, which looks like this. So we are going to try and plant both of them and see which one grows and which one doesn't. And lastly, we have bought a mint plant. So this is called Mint Strawberry. Uh, so mints are really easy to grow and I've been wanting to grow them for some time now so I decided to get them and try them out. So these are all the plants we have and let's go ahead and plant them. The ash is just leveling that part and we are going to be planting them. And uh, another thing, so that there's nothing happening with the cilantro seeds. No matter what we try, maybe we're doing it very wrong. So we're just gonna take out half the plot, uh, just scramble it and reuse this place to plant the other things. So let's go to that. Okay, so what I'm going to do now is plant this uh, tomato plant inside the hole that I have uh, dug. So yesterday when I was watching a YouTube video, I came across some tips. One of the tips were like you would want to plant the tomato uh, plant as deep as possible so that uh, you know there is a good base for those plants uh, and their roots and then you know it can give you more um, tomatoes yeah so that's one and secondly uh, another tip I was given was to put the compost underneath and then um, go ahead and water them such that the ground is very very wet so that uh, the tomato plant has enough water to grow for the next few days. The roots have enough water and nutrients to grab. Yeah. So that's what I'm going to do now. Let's go. Probably I'm just going to add some mud to make it a little better, I guess. Because I do not want it to be so so wet yeah so let me do something else with it it's like you're mixing cement with <laughs> water yeah <laughs> illiterate plant people like us going through so many things yes maybe i have to dug another hole it's too much too wet no? i don't know oh yes. look what i found what another swab we are not going to hurt it, so Just we... put it on the other side. Which side? Just on that side. Okay. Go a drone. Okay. Okay. This is... Me unwrapping it. And... Uh, I guess we just have to tear it out. See all the roots are here. Oh god. So there you go. A beautiful tomato plant with a lot of roots in it. So I'm just going to 
uh, yeah so one more tip the person gave is try to go as deep as you can and all these hairs that you see over here are going to be transformed to a root so what i'm going to do is take out all the leaves here so that the plant can focus more on uh, you know growing more roots and it can go deeper inside so there i am i have added it now i'm just going to yeah cover it with a lot of uh, soil all right and there is our tomato plant so this is the first tomato plant we have over here now we are going to plant the second one so so i think that's about it okay two tomato plants that that now we're going to just wrap up here water it maybe maybe water it later let's do the next planting we're just going to do a little bit of digging to see how the seeds that we planted those uh, coriander seeds we planted how she's ash is digging out so ash what is the progress so i found one see it does have something growing on it so um, i guess we just have to keep watering them yeah we yeah. have to water them a lot not just like show sure, other seeds other seeds let me find oh there yeah. oh there are a lot more look yeah. at them what do you mean see those are sprouted yeah those white white ones are sprouted yeah see who oh, small one coming out so uh, it seems like they were growing <laughs> but uh, i thought we were supposed to wait for just 10 days and the plants <laughs> supposed to come out so i don't know what should we do at this point so since we are checking progresses let's check on the chili as well if there's any progress on the chili plant can't find any chili maybe the chili disappeared no it disappeared the birds ate it <laughs> Or maybe we plant our mint mm here. -hmm. Seems like nothing is there. We disrupt this and plant here. Okay, seems like we lost the chili. So unfortunately, we could not find any chili seeds in there. Uh, Wait, is that the earthworm? Earthworm? What earthworm? This thing. Is that earthworm? No. No, no, it's just a root. So, could not. Oh my God, we left the earthworm there, right? And I just scraped the whole ground. I think it will be fine. <laughs> Anyways, no chili seeds were found, so we decided, you know what, scrap the chili seeds. We're gonna put um, mint here, right? Yeah. So we're gonna put mint here. And these are mint strawberry, if you can see. Why they are called that? Again, I saw a YouTube video. It's because they smell like strawberry. <laughs> 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 Let me try. Ah, okay, I get it. <laughs> In the middle, I'm getting it. Ah. Yes. Okay. <laughs> okay. So let's plant this. Hope we are able to keep these plants Ooh. as healthy as we got them. We are gonna do our best not to kill them. Hopefully. Mm. So. Yesterday I saw the guy a mint video where the guy was like shake the roots of it shake the roots of it so I'm shaking them all our knowledge comes from youtube <laughs> and line lord <laughs> oh are you what fell down no you have to hold it again i know hold it and then push in the I'm mud i'm tired whose roots loose i hope i'm not torturing it Okay. Now we plant our mint. Our chintu mint which is going to grow and become big. big. All right. 
to be honest i am the most excited for this mint plant of course mm-hmm. there are tomatoes which i want to enjoy why are you excited for mint i don't know it just keeps growing i guess so it's nice I always wanted to grow a mint plant for some reason so i guess i'm finally growing one okay so i'm happy about it tomato don't feel bad <laughs> it's not biasness so i'm not going to disrupt this part which is going to dig a couple of hole over here and then stick the plant in or oh, here stick the plant in is digging up the hole and this is the plant some leaves don't really look very healthy uh yesterday it was fine but today i guess it was still sitting out for a while so let's just plant it anyway let's see what happens Over there, mankind has given her tools, but she prefers to use her hand. No, oh, I forgot that. They use this. <laughs> <laughs> okay. okay, she forgot. Sorry. <laughs> eh, hey, nice. Okay, so many roots, but so little things. Oh, I can smell it. Yeah, I can smell it. Smell the coriander as soon as it came out of the tub. Nice. Please grow. Please. so that we can use you for biryani and fish fry and for all the or the garnishing you can use for yeah grow so that we may tear you apart eh <laughs> dai <laughs> no no <laughs> it will die you mm. feel like that don't feel like that okay. time for the second one this one is already done second one The roots are growing on this thing. So how do I peel it off? Just peel it off. Ignore the roots. Break the roots. Yeah, yeah, just break it. Break it. Hmm. Yeah, that is last plant to plant. See the sunset. The sun is setting. Yeah. Yeah. Since you worked so hard, I will give you the gift of watering the plants. It's therapeutic. Sure. <laughs> yeah. Let's see what happens. Mm-hmm. 